what is up my crazy subscriber this is joking jealousy before here bring guys more banner 15 ultimate team and also welcome to game number five of season five but before we get into more details about the gameplay guys i would like to say this real quick the reason why i didn't upload for the past two days is because i couldn't get online PSN was down, Xbox was, Xbox was down, so I couldn't do no solo challenges, I couldn't do large quick sales, I couldn't play a game, I couldn't go into Call of Duty, because you know guys, I told you a long time ago, there was going to be Madden Daily, there's going to be Call of Duty Daily, there's going to be GTA Daily, you know, but I failed in all of them because PSN was down, and by the way, I was off for 5 freaking days, but PSN was down all the way from Wednesday night, I believe, so it was down for, for 3 days. And in those three days, I could use like uh, that time to create at least two weeks worth of content, you know. But no, damn it, hacking group, whoever it was, there's a squad or whoever the fuck it was, damn you, because I could have created a lot of content here for my subs, for my 1,300 subs. But no. <sighs> Anyways, enough of my little rants for the online world and PSN. Uh, we're gonna be talking about this gameplay now. In the gameplay guys, I want you to keep an eye on Bo Jackson and also on my new jerseys. I'm currently using the New York Giants jersey. The reason why is because I feel like I kind of reached full potential already. And I was like, yeah, why not use the New York Giants jersey? So uh, if you guys don't like them, I'll, I'm willing to change over to the Broncos orange jerseys or to the Navy Blue Bears jerseys. So either or, you guys can vote right there. If not, you guys can pick something else and I'll use some, some other jerseys. So anyways, on my first drive, I ended up scoring with uh, my backup. Uh, who was Doug Martin, he made one of the smoothest turns of all time and then I ended up back on defense and Bo Jackson from my opponent's team he took it all the freaking way for 70 yard touchdown that was fucking like unbelievable I was like what the fuck you know you just you just like juke like half of my team that was like around 7 players right there 6 to 7 players I don't know how many there were but god damn it, he took it all the way from a screen so that's why I'm telling you guys, use Bo Jackson right now. Not only me, I'm using him, everybody using him because he has 90 overall and has like shitloads of speed. He is worth the use, man. So uh, anyways, I uh, ended up back in offense, doing my thing, I'm passing, I'm developing new passing plays and also some kind of a new slide protection, which is kind of working with Bo Jackson perfectly. I can already imagine myself with Emmett Smith or Jamal Charles. I'm actually going to start picking up Jamal Charles at some, at some point. So keep an eye on that. I'm going to start gathering for that guy. He's going to be super badass since he does kind of have the same speed as Bo Jackson. So anyways, ended up back on defense. Antonio Cromartie with a nice pick. He currently has six picks this season. And he's like 83 overall. I'm surprised by him though. He's doing a lot better than uh, Mr. Brandon Browner, the uh, to the uh, season four MVP. So Antonio Cromartie is still a hell of a player. But I still want somebody better though. I'm still looking towards somebody better. Don't worry guys, he ain't gonna stay there forever. So I ended up back in the offense because of the kick return. I ended up receiving on the second half, third quarter, three minutes uh, to go. Bo Jackson with a nice little misdirection right there on the out of the weak formation. Nice, you know, run by him. You know, I mean, he, telling you, he fights for yards. And then I did a little bit of a mistake right there. Yes, I know guys, I should have lobbed it. A lot of you guys will be smacking me in the head right now, telling me that, you know, that was a kind of a big mistake right there that you did. Yeah, I know guys, I know. So I ended up back on defense, and this guy, this guy loves screens. As you can see, he already did one, two screens. Bo Jackson taking it both for almost 10 yards each. And the third time's a charm. Will he score? What would happen right now? Calling Cabernet, calling some kind of route right there. Bo Jackson gets popped by Prince Amukamara. I repeat, Prince Amukamara. And get how, get, guess how much overall does he have? He has 80 overall. 80 overall, Prince Mukamara popped the shit out of 90 overall, Bo Jackson. That's exactly what happened right there, guys. That's the highlight of the day. Freaking Prince Mukamara, man. I'm telling you, I should probably get the 90 overall of that of that guy. There is a 90 overall version of Prince Mukamara. Oh, you a badass pickup. So anyways, my opponent ended up quitting, which is good. Um... You know, he was he was going to dominate with Bo Jackson, but he really got his shit knocked out of him like in that last play that he did on offense. He shouldn't have gone for three times freaking screens. He should have learned his lesson the, the freaking first time that he did screens. On his first drive, that's why I ended up going into a quick scoring offense in my first quarter. So that's it, guys. If you guys like the game, make sure you leave a like on the video. And also, tell me if you like that freaking pop by Prince of Mukamaro. That has to be like an epic tackle, a big hit, whatever you want to call it. 
Prince of Kamara has to be the most underdog player of this whole team. He, re he really does. He really does look like an, uh, an underdog. So that's it, guys. Leave a like, leave a comment, tell me what's up. If you guys want to see more of this, make sure you leave a like on the video to show your support. And also, the playlist are already located on my main channel, so you might want to click on my name. So that's it, guys. I'll see you guys later, and subscribe for more.